you know that school is coming to a close, and with that, our libraries are also going to be closed with the exception of Story Hour, which you have already received the notice for, which will be at Mitnick. But just because the school library is closed doesn't mean all libraries are closed. We still have a lot of great um, programs available to you at our county library. So can we have Ms. Tara and Ingrid here to talk to you about the children and teen library programs for the summer. Good morning, Sam Man. My name is Tara, and I'm a children's librarian for the Cape May County Library. And this is Ingrid. I'll give her the mic in a minute to talk. Um, we just want to remind you that the public library is open, and we have eight branches within the Cape May County Library system. Of course, the closest one to you all is probably the one in Lower Township in the Villas. We have Cape May City, Wildwood Crest, Cape May Courthouse, Stone Harbor. Uh, let's see, Wood Woodbine, uh, Seattle City and Upper Township. So when we tell you what's going on this summer at the library, it's happening at all of those branches. Um, so I'm gonna start first. We have two different programs that running this summer. We have the children's program, and then we have the teen program. The children's program runs up to age 12, including age 12. If you're 12 or older, you also can decide if you'd rather join the teen reading program. It really just depends on what your interests are and the prizes probably. So let me tell you a little bit about the children's program first. Um, the past few days I think you were given one of these to take home to your grown-up. This tells you about uh, when and where you can sign up for the program. You can sign up at any one of those eight branches I just mentioned and you can sign up starting on June 26th and the program runs until August 18th. Our first event will run, if you're closest to Lower Township, will run on Monday, June 26th at 6.30. We'll have uh, science tellers come and do a little show and you can sign up. Let me show you what you get when you sign up. This year's theme is Build a Better World and it'll be for both the children's and the teen library or program is Build a Better World and it sounds like what it is. It's about building but it's also about Reminding us to build a better community, better world that we want to live in, and you can do things like that by recycling, uh, volunteering, being a good friend. Those are some things to think of. But let me show you what you'll get um, in the back. Okay. Once you sign up, you'll get uh, the student, the summer reading log and quest. This has 16 quests in it to do, and this is how you'll keep track of your books. It has the summer reading events calendar, everything that's going on, seven weeks of the program, every week we will have something going on at the library. You'll get a Build a Better World bookmark, pencil, and tattoo. Okay, so you get all that just for signing up. Something I want to remind you, or when you sign up, is that you guys will get to set your own reading goal. We won't set it for you. Everybody's at different reading levels and likes to read different kinds of books. So you guys will set up your own reading goal. The five children's librarians set up a goal for Cape May County. We're hoping that all the children that participate read 12,000 books. So that's our goal, but you guys are going to pick your own goal, and each of you, if you meet your goal, that'll work toward those 12,000 that we're hoping to get. Um, let's see. So you, every week you'll just keep track in that little book and you can bring it into the library and let me show you some of the prizes that you'll get. You can build a better world by getting built, planting seeds, a little flower garden. Get construction rubber duckies. Lego bubbles. Construction stickers. A Lego block bank. Put your coins in the top there and you can remove them at the bottom. Then one of the weeks we're giving away books. Brand new books. These are just a few of the, sorry, a few of the examples that you can get. Joke books, Big Nate, chapter books. If you meet your reading goal, you're going to get a medal. Also, if you meet your reading goal, you get one ticket in for the grand prize drawing, which is a huge Lego set. We're gonna have a few uh, set Lego sets in the grand prize, along with Lego books and Lego movies. Another important thing to remember is in this reading log are 16 extra chances for 16 more tickets into the grand prize drawing. 
there are activities in here. If you, every time you do an activity, you get another ticket in. So if you complete this whole book and meet your reading goal, you'll have 17 tickets in for the grand prize drawing. Right, I just got a couple more things to add. So like I said, every week we're gonna have an event at one of the, li at the library branches. I'm gonna tell you about some of those events. If you're having a board summer day and you want something to do, come to the library. All the events are free and signing up for the program is free as well. So first we're gonna have science tellers. They're gonna be doing some storytelling and they do experiments. They invite kids up from the audience to participate with them. And then we're gonna have Wild Animals of New Jersey Nature, a local man who rescues animals. We'll be talking about how he rescues animals, his way of making the world better. And he will be bringing some of those animals in to share with you guys. Then we're gonna have Family Stages Presents Puss and Boots. Next week is Creative Construction Activities, Crafts and Fun. Then the next week will be a Shadow Puppet Show. Uh, July 31st is a concert with Mr. John. The following week, August 7th, a lot of you guys might like this, is Beauty and the Beast play. Two actors are going to come do the play and they switch out and change into all of the different costumes. Uh, then August 14th is our summer reading finale. At that finale, you'll have extra opportunities to win more Lego sets. You will also be able to get your reading medal. And this is the important thing. If we meet our 12,000 goal, we're going to pick five children that are at the reading finale and let them silly string the librarians. Then to wrap up the whole summer reading uh, program, we have a big party out at the Seattle City Library that will be on Wednesday, August 23rd at 10 a.m. and run for two hours. It's gonna be a Lego themed party. It'll be a lot of fun. So I'm gonna pass the mic over to Ingrid now and she'll tell you about the teen program. Like I said, if you're 12 years old, you can choose which one you wanna do. If you would prefer to do the children's program or the teen program. All right, so sign up for the teen program. All you have to do is go to any of the libraries and pick up this handy dandy reading log and write your name, email, and phone number. On the inside, the way we're gonna keep track of all your activities, it's kind of like a, a bingo sheet with things like read outside, commit a random act of kindness, visit a library, and you can check those off every time you do them. And then for every 10 activities you complete, you can bring it to any library and you get one free book. For every 20 activities you complete, you get two free books and this handy dandy little sheet gets sent off to me and the other teen librarian and entered into a weekly raffle prize for fun things like gift cards and Funko Pop uh, things. And then at the very end, our grand prize raffle drawing, once you've at least completed one of these, is an iPod, iPad, excuse me, iPad mini that you can potentially win. We also have some fun activities going on, such as a creative writing workshop going on Wednesday evenings with an instructor from Rowan University, a crocheting workshop Mondays if you want to learn how to make little tea cozies or fingerless mittens. We also have a Dungeons and Dragons group that meets every Wednesday afternoon. Uh, what else? Oh right, uh, there's a, a gaming group that does board games and video games. We have three consoles set up. The popular thing now is Super Smash Bros. And that meets Thursday afternoons. And we also have a teen photography contest going on where you can take photos, submit them to the teen department in the categories of Cape May County, so anything you think represents the county, nature, so anything you feel represents that, trees, the ocean, if you see a dolphin, your neighbor's dog. And then the last one is our summer reading theme, Build a Better World. So what do you think represents in picture format building a better world? And you can submit those to us and you will win, be able to win prizes based on first, second, third, and best of show in each category. So I'm really glad you came down to listen to us talk, and I really hope to see you this summer at the library. Remember, the library is free for everything and fun. If you're bored this summer, come to see us at the Cape May Courthouse branch, especially if you can go upstairs and work, uh, check out our Technology Learning Center. There's a lot of fun things up there to do and learn about, okay?